close the distance, gain a dominant position, and finish the fight. The number one goal of combatives is to strengthen the Army's core of soldiers and teach them how to close with the enemy and eventually come out on top. It builds my confidence, you know, inside the cage and outside, like, because I, I know I can handle myself. We're training warriors. We're living up to the warrior ethos that we talk about in our creeds, and uh, we're passing that on through physical and mental toughness. There's always been a misconception about combatives being a sport. Combatives is not a sport. Army combatives, the modern Army combatives program is not for sport. It's through competition that we learn the lessons that we need to learn, what works for us and our body types. It is a vital and crucial element to a soldier's success in the field. I've deployed myself, and I've had to use my hands overseas. The fact that I knew I could gave me the confidence to know that I knew exactly what I needed to do. I think that every soldier needs that and it just adds to what a soldier is. Giving someone a reason to push themselves, to train, to be the best person they can be, that's what the tournaments do. A competition like this provides that realistic training without the risk of losing a life, losing a limb, or getting seriously injured because our goal of the tournament is to make sure that everybody gets that training and then is able to go to work tomorrow. Yeah, it is an acknowledgement of their hard work, their, their effort that they put into it. It's an acknowledgement of the training that they've received uh, throughout that time. Whereas in a regular training environment, a regular class, it's just training. Right? Yeah, you have to exert yourself a little bit, but it's just training. Through competition, that's how we identify the true nature and spirit of the warrior. Oh, <laughs>